Hello, my name is Peter Halbert from Heidelberg, USA. Today we're going to talk about coating and coating viscosity. Viscosity is a, a liquid's resistance to flow based on time and temperature. So why is it important for us to know about viscosity? We have a tolerance for viscosity, sometimes 35 seconds, sometimes 45 seconds. The tolerance is plus minus 5 seconds, depends on press room temperature. And we must be inside this tolerance to make sure we don't have application problems. When we measure viscosity, we need a DIN 4 cup for Europe, a ZAN 3 cup for the US, we need a stopwatch, and we need some stirring devices. So for small drums, we can use a small stir here. Larger drums, we can use the paddle. And for even larger drums, we can use a mechanical agitation device. Safira coating labels have a number for the viscosity, 35 seconds or 45 seconds, but this is based on the DIN 4 cup. So a general rule of thumb for the ZAN 3 cup is to divide that number by two. Normally we have a viscosity here in the US, roughly 18 to 20 seconds. So why do we have two different coating viscosity numbers? Well, in, inside the press, we have a two roller system and a chamber doctor blade system. Normally for the two roller coating application system, we select the 35 second viscosity and for the chamber doctor blade, we take the 45 second viscosity. Now I'd like to demonstrate the correct way to measure the viscosity. Step one, agitate the coating. We'll use the DIN 4 cup. Step two, fully submerge the DIN 4 cup. Have the stopwatch ready to start. As soon as we lift the DIN 4 cup out of the coating, we're gonna start the stopwatch. You can see the constant steady stream of coating draining from the DIN 4 cup. We have to get ready to stop the stopwatch as soon as the stream breaks for the very first time. This will tell us the viscosity number. Okay. This coating was 38 seconds viscosity. Normally, we have to then check the press room temperature or the coating temperature. Temperature and viscosity are very closely related. The warmer the environment, the lower the viscosity. The colder the environment, the higher the viscosity. So now I want to demonstrate how to measure using the ZAN 3 cup and then we can compare the difference between DIN 4 cup number and ZAN 3 number. So the same idea as before, fully submerge in the coating. As soon as we lift out of the coating, we start the stopwatch. Okay, so this one was 19 seconds. So there we can see roughly the difference between DIN 4 and uh, ZAN 3, DIN 4 was 38 seconds, ZAN 3, 19 seconds, exactly half. So what do we do if we have an unusual number? If the number is too low, then we might have application problems like slinging in a two roller system on a high speed press. For the chamber doctor blade, as long as the number is above 18, 19 seconds, it should be okay, and the viscosity can be up to as high as 50 seconds and we should be able to print application trouble free. So thank you very much for listening and we hope that this video has helped you in your application processes. Happy printing.